Good evening, everyone, and thank you so much for joining us on the Halachapedia channel in our Shabbat section. This time we'll be discussing Borer, which is one of the 39 categories of prohibited work on Shabbat. So the name of the category is Borer, and what it means is selecting, pulling out, which, um, which would be taking out of a mixture something that you don't want, and thereby making the mixture better and more uh, usable. So for example, if back in the day when they would uh, th um, thresh the wheat, what they would do is they would take out of all of the uh, clean wheat, they would take out the uh, pebbles and things that didn't belong there, that would be borer. Or if you sift, um, if you sift flour and take out all of the um, things that you don't want there, that can be an example of borer. So borer means really to just take out the stuff that you don't want out of the selection that you uh, do want. Now, this really presents us with a difficult situation, which is, how is it that we ever have our Shabbat meals without violating this prohibition? Because we all know that there's always that salad that we take the part that we do want, and we all know that there are certain things that we choose what we like and leave behind what we don't like. So when is something included in this prohibition on the selection, and when is something out of that prohibition? And the answer is very simple. There are three simple guidelines, uh, and if those are met, then we're all clear of borer. There's really simple, and um, it really makes life pretty easy. So the number one simple uh, guideline is that you gotta be taking the good from the bad. So what you do is, um, good from bad would be, for example, um, if you are, um, if you are, let's say, eating uh, cucumbers and tomatoes, and you only want the cucumbers, if you're taking only cucumbers, that is good from bad, right? You don't want, obviously the tomatoes are not bad, but it means what you desire versus what you do not desire. So if you're taking what you desire, if you're taking those cucumbers, that's fine, as long as you're not pulling out the part that you don't want and putting it aside, that's fine. As long as you're eating normally and consuming the stuff that you want, that's okay. That is category number one. If you meet that, then you're good. Number two is um, immediate use. If you are uh, consuming something and you're about to eat it immediately, that's fine. Right? However, if you're consuming something and you're setting it aside in this way, but you're not going to eat it till much, much later, that's not okay because that becomes more of a work type of thing. If it's just like eating normally, that's fine. But if you're setting it aside for later, that's not okay. So as long as you're having the good from the bad and doing it for immediate use, that is okay. Uh, and third category, last but not least, is uh, hand, which means as follows. As long as you're not using a professional utensil, as long as you're uh, using either a hand, a fork, or a knife, nothing too complicated, you're good. However, if you're using a sifter or anything complex, then you um, are in violation. So basically, we have these three categories for borer. If you meet them all, you're allowed to select and um, there's no problem. So again, it's good from bad, making sure you take those cucumbers from the tomatoes and not the other way around. It's doing it for immediate use and not doing it, let's say, not preparing a salad Friday night that you're only going to be using uh, Shabbat afternoon. And last one is hand. You got to be doing it with your hand. doesn't mean actually your hands, but it just means that you're doing it with a utensil that's not dedicated for selection. You're not doing it with a sifter, a strainer, uh, or anything like that. All that met. You are clear. Enjoy your meal. Thank you so much for joining the Halachapedia channel uh, on the Shabbat section discussing this important topic of Borer selection. Thank you.